Good. Good? Great. Friday. Any anything interesting at school? I'm 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 played flicking a stone at school at the free time of school. I played flicking a stone. What is flicking a stone? Just is like it. there is a board with some line with some lines on it and yeah. then you flick a stone living like this. Mm -hmm. And your enemy, which is your friend, you're playing with your friend. Okay. You flick a stone like this, mm. and the stone goes here, and then knock off the enemy's stone. Ah, uh, the goal is to knock off. Knock the stone right off the board. Then what's what's the objective? If this was a board, mm -hmm. here's the stones. Yep. And there's a lot of stones in here. Mm -hmm. One most important stones. If you flick one stone, then if you flick one stone like this, mm -hmm. knocks off the other stone out of the board. Okay. And the other enemy person flicks a stone, knocks off your stone. Okay. And then you have to. How many stones do you have? Do you play with? Normally three. Okay. Are they actual stones, like rocks, or are they paper or something? Probably plastic. Okay, cool. Interesting. So how... One team is black, and one team is white. Okay. Then is it just... two players? How many players do you have? Two. Okay. If this is black and this is white, they have to fight each other. Mm. Until... And... Until... Until somebody, until somebody has no more stones left. Like, there's three stones in here. Flick one stone, knock off this stone. Mm -hmm. Flick one stone, miss. Misses, yeah. And flick a one stone, and hits, but only moves a little bit, and you goes flying off the board. Okay. You play like that until right. somebody's stone is all gone. Like, there's no stone in here? Yep, there's the one stones stone. are all gone. Um, I played... Public of Korea Student Art Contest today. Cool. That's, what's that about? I went to an art academy. Just to, Can you say that one again? I went to... I went to an art academy. Okay. And, and there, I took part in the Republic of Korea Student Art Contest today. Cool. Well done. What was... Uh, Describe that a bit more. What are some of the? What is it about? Where is it? Why is it held? That that drawing is Star is about Star Wars. You drew a drawing about Star Wars. Yes. Okay. Its name, its, its title, is Battle to the Stars. Okay. And it is uh, about Mandalorian fighting Darth Vader. Ah. And there's an X-Wing starfighter flying by and shooting laser cannons and stuff. Cool. Uh, I think maybe laser beams. Laser beams. Oops. Um, great. So how did you make the picture? In Star Wars, they call it laser cannons. Oh, okay. Yeah, that makes sense. I haven't watched Star Wars in a while. It's been a while. Um, how did you make the drawing? Was it a drawing or a painting or what did you do? Stro I draw it and then painted it. Good. I drew first, it. I, I drew, drew it. I drew it and then painted. All right. Drew it first. Drew it with a pencil, mm -hmm. and then redraw it with really thin marker pens. Good. Redrew right. it. Redrew it. Redrew it with really thin marker pens. Yeah. Zero point zero. I drew it with. 0 0.1 millimeter. Okay, very one, thin. One, mil one millimeter thin. Mm. So, I got it. Redraw a bit. You went over then, the pencil marks? And then painted it. Okay, yeah. what color? Or what colors? Mm, colors is black. The color is brown, red, and some flames. Oh. I have some picture. I have a picture. Oh, wait. Uh, uh. This is too... I think it's too bright. Right. Yeah. Ah, you can dim it. Make it less bright to dim. Okay. Oh, wow. Wow.
that's super good. Um, all right, so there's is the guy in the cape the uh, I forget it's his name. Darth Vader. Darth Vader, and it's then Mandalorian. Okay. It's actually flying, not running. And then there's yeah, well done. And then what's behind it? A spaceship. Uh, this is X-wing starfighter. X-wing starfighter. Great. Good job. How long did that take you? Um, how long? About how long do you think it took you? Uh, two hours and a half. Two and a half hours. Wow. Well done. Did you? How did you get the the figures so accurate? Were you looking at a a picture of Star Wars or? Yeah, I looked at a picture of Star Wars. And then I looked at it and drawn it. And drew it. Yeah. And drew. It. I looked at it and drew it. And also, I told an AI to draw, draw, Whoa. draw it for me. Interesting. The AI, AI was Chat GPT. Yeah. And he cool. drawed it for me. Drew, drew it. Drew it. Drew it. Yep. Um, then, those things are called I, text to image. I looked at that. Yeah. And then I was look keep looking at the picture in drawer. Yeah. I kept looking at the picture and drawing. Yeah. All right. That's the picture. Yeah. Well done. So this, um, it was like an, a bunch of people came and sh uh, displayed and about, their pictures. Oh, I got a lot of trophies. Okay. Oh, yeah. I got one, two, oh. and three trophies. Well done. And where's all the metal? And I have one of the pictures in here. <laughs> okay, so you did multiple pictures. Oh, cool. You can understand Space, it aliens. because you can understand it because it's all English. Okay. Well, uh, can you tell me? I can't read too too much the the fine print. What does it say? Certificate of Arts. Yeah. Well done. Grand prize. And this is just my Korean name, just spelled like that. Yeah. Spelled like that, strangely. So. But, yeah. Great. Yeah, well done. So that was at your school, or was that a separate thing? It was on an art, art contest as well. Okay. It was an a big art contest. Yeah. This is the same art contest as this. And this... And this drawing, and I got this from that drawing. From the drawing you just showed me? Yes. Okay. And It's two is, years ago. It was two years ago? Yeah. This thing Good word. Impressive. To, this thing got to go to you, the United States. Really? Wow. That's interesting. What's, tell me more about that. What do you mean it went to the United States? I drew, I drew it so well. That that the that the guys that that the guys that look at my picture and decide what what prize should they give me. Mm. Those and guys are called. And they were so impressed. They send my picture into the United States and stuff. Cool. I well draw done. really hard. I drawed really hard at this contest. It's I think it's going to get the uh, top prize. Top prize. Good. The this, so this is the second top prize. Okay. Now second I'm place. going to get the top prize. Uh, yeah, first one. So yeah. a few words. Let's go over a few words. The guys who decide if you're what prize you get. They're called judges. Oh, judges. Yeah. So the judges liked your picture. Wow. This picture? Karate. These two persons are fighting. These, yep. These two people. Are Tai Guan Doing and fighting. Mm -hmm. Tai Guan Doing. Um, these two people are, are doing Taekwondo. Yeah. Great. Yeah. Interesting. And they're black belts? Is that what it yeah, is? Yeah, black belt. Great. Um, yes. yeah, yeah, cool. Do you, what's that move? Just kind of a fun kick? Yes, this guy is trying to kick this guy. This guy is trying to kick this guy's face, mm. but 
He ducked. He ducked. Good. He ducked and he dodged. Dodged the kick. And what do you call the guy behind them? The third third guy? This guy? The guy this in the guy middle. This guy is yeah. telling them what to do and telling yeah. them the rules and stuff. The rules. What do we? What's his job? What do we call him? Um, oh. Referee. Referee. Yep. Just like in soccer, they have the, the referees. People who... This is Japan. This is Korea. <laughs> Follows the rules. So one one of the fighters is from Japan, the other one from Korea. This one is from Japan. This one is from Korea. This cool. is the line that divides that two <laughs> and stuff. Oh. Um, I just want to go over one word. When you said the Chat GPT thing, yes. that is called a text to image generator so you type in what you want right i want to see yeah. a guy in space then it creates an image but that guy isn't a bit able to draw images oh ah, okay eh. but you played with the ai yeah he just can draw some plane or he can just draw it can just draw a plane or an aircraft Mm. And some other people and other things in the world and yeah. in space. Yeah, as well. And hey, you I can't yeah. draw any, anything fighting because that's images. Yeah, it's violent, maybe. Um, the I see your T-shirt says, uh, or your shirt says, uh, Boston. Yeah, that's where I grew up near, maybe one hour from there. Boston. Yeah, do you know what's... I don't know. You know anything about Boston? No. Ah, it's uh, famous for uh, universities. Harvard University. Um, many famous universities are in Boston, city of Boston. Cool. Um, so were you able to see the uh, article, Four New Astronauts? Yes. Um, we're kind of coming toward the end, so maybe we'll read it, and then we'll we'll discuss the questions more Okay. Uh, next time. So, I'm yeah. Read it. NASA has revealed the names of four astronauts who will venture into space and orbit around the moon in the spacecraft for the first time in 50 years. On November 2024, Victor Glover, Jeremy Hansen, yep. Christina Koch, and Koch and Reed. Reed when Wiseman will travel to the moon and an Orion spacecraft for the Kennedy Space Center in Florida. Coach is the first woman ever to be a part of lunar, lunar. lunar mission. She had previously stayed in space for record 328 days. Whoa. Lover is the first African-American astronaut ever to be assigned to a lunar mission. He's right. also the first African-American to live on the International Space Station for more than six months. Mm. Their mission, named Artemis II, is expected okay. to take about 10 days. There's a possibility that these four astronauts will venture deeper into space than any human has ever before. Artemis II will pave the way for Artemis III, which will be the first mission to put humans on the moon since 1972. It's more than a mission that has to happen before we send people to the surface of the moon. It is the next step on the journey that gets humanity to Mars, said Glover. Yeah, well done. Very well pronounced. Um, only a few tiny things. Um, what do we do? Ah, lunar. Lunar mission. Lunar mission. Yeah. Lunar uh, basically means moon. Luna, it's an old word for moon. So a lunar mission is what? Mission to the moon. A lunar spacecraft is a spaceship for the moon. Um, lunar satellite, satellite for the moon. The second word was assigned. Can you say that one? 
Assigned. Assigned. The teacher assigned us homework. Um, yeah. Can you use assigned in a sentence? You can use mine. You, the teacher is, yeah. you gave us this article. I assigned I me an article. Yep. I assigned you an article. Great. Yeah, perfect. Uh, new use. The four astronauts had taken a lunar mission. Good. The four astronauts um, are going on a lunar mission. Great. Any, um, oh yeah, venture. What about the word venture? A venture. Very risky. The International Space Station? Yes. What's that? The astronaut, where the astronauts, ast astronauts live. Yeah. Why is it called International Space Station? Why international? Because it was cre created by a lots of countries from different yeah. places. Very good. A lot of countries collaborated to make it. Um, wow, we're already coming up toward the end for today. So we will continue on um, Wednesday. Next Wednesday, we'll just we'll talk about the questions in this article. Does that sound good? Yes. Great. All right. Well, enjoy your weekend. It was nice chatting with you. And I will see you next Wednesday. Goodbye. Bye-bye.